Hey, what's happening everyone? Sir James from GamerFusion.com and we are here to play Eagle's Flight on the PlayStation VR. I got early access to the game courtesy of GamerFusion, but you may be seeing this video at a later point in time. But I'll let you guys enjoy the scene because, you know, it's all about the atmosphere, the music, just everything about it. And all I guess is that if you the have... The sun rises comes, over the beautiful okay. city of Paris. Humans have long left this iconic city behind, and the wilderness has reclaimed the streets. Deer and wolves have made their homes here, sharing this urban jungle with exotic animals escaped from the zoo. Predators search for their next meal, scavengers feast on the remains of a kill, while other threats lurk in the shadows. Your journey is only just beginning, but soon you will take your place in this world. Uh, one of the things I was trying to say is that if you have neck problems, you may not like this game because you turn your neck to do uh, turns and stuff. Eagles turn by tilting their head. So let's get up in the air really quick. All right, I think this is safe. There you go. <laughs> Controls are simple. I really love this, just being able to fly around. So this is kind of like the tutorial section. They kind of free roam too. Guess the tutorial is over. All right, so that's your nest. All we have to do is fly through it to go to the lobby. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, what we're going to go ahead and do is that we are actually going to do the story mode. Cause I tried playing online, but I don't think there's a lot of early reviewers yet at the moment, at least for PlayStation. I think the game is out already for the Vive. Uh, but there's some cool locations. There's a free roam, but you'll see it in the menu. Make sure we are centered here. So this is actually pretty cool. So here is the main menu. Uh, there's no other online players at the moment, but we, there's a story mode that we're gonna do. Uh, free flight. So you could just explore and just have the freedom of flights, which honestly, I have no sickness at all while playing this game because I really love being able to fly. I've always wanted to know how it felt. Game day for the captures, but there is online. You can actually look around. There's a full 360 pan around, which you'll see in the story mode here in a second. But let's go ahead and do that right now. But again, this game is called Eagle's Flight. It's available on PlayStation VR and the HTC Vive is the other one. I think there's one other platform. So again, really visually well done. So a bird's life is the story. I've only done the first part, but it's just awesome. But I want to try to talk less so you guys could enjoy. Hungry and alone in the dark, instinct compels you to move toward heat and light. 
someone is waiting for you in the outside world. Your mother and father. And someone else. over Paris have taught your parents everything there is to know about the city. Each district is full of life, prey and predators, dark corners and safe havens. One day, you too will know them all. Elephants like to assemble around the Louvre, the waterways here are teeming with fish, but watch out for the opportunistic vultures. Once a testament to human engineering, the Eiffel Tower has been reclaimed by nature. It still offers magnificent views, but only to the birds lucky enough to nest there. Crows hang around the Sacre Coeur Basilica, using the tight alleyways to antagonize their prey and overcome predators with their wits. Bears also love the caverns under the hill. The shadowy archways and stone ceilings of the Pantheon provide an ideal refuge for the city's bats. Wolves are often seen roaming near the botanical garden, which is more jungle now than garden. Finally, Notre Dame. This part of the city has always been a refuge a safe haven amidst the busy streets. This is your home. All right, so chapter one, taking flight. This is just pretty cool, man. I really like this. Are we centered again? All right, I was moving around a lot. <laughs> but this is really, really cool. I think Ubisoft did a really good job with this title. I forget how much it was. I think it was 40 bucks, but I have to see how the online multiplayer is first. But yeah, really cool. So let's go ahead and continue. Paris has kept its magnificence under the reign of the animals. Nature here can be both beautiful and brutal. But you will find your place. Your wings are growing stronger, and you are slowly learning all that's needed to become a great bald eagle.
Alright, so the light beam indicates the next story challenge. Some giraffes down there. Alright, so let's go ahead and do that. So that's your menu screen, but we are doing story. Other animals have chosen this district as their home. Let's see who they are. Fly through the center of the rings for a speed of bonus. Boom, mastered that. <laughs> Retry, return to intro, or continue. We will continue. As you know, there are no humans left. Kind of reminds me of The Last of Us. Alright, number two. I think we'll do this one, maybe one other, depending on how long these take. Oh yeah, I gotta fly through the, uh... Yeah, I actually gotta fly through the icon. Like every living creature, you need a safe home. Fetch feathers available in the area to improve your nest. Let's go ahead and collect some feathers. Is that <laughs> I 
Alright, let's go ahead and continue. What's next, sticks? Hey, we are. so there's collectibles in the game. Alright, new collectibles. You can now collect feathers all around the city. As to how many there are, what do they unlock? I have no idea. Customize your eagle? <laughs> Just kidding. Alright, so it's the progress in story mode to unlock new chapters and more challenges. Okay, oh, maybe that's what it's for. Earn stars to unlock expert challenges. So we have 9 out of 30. So, yeah, there's, there's a lot more to this uh, story mode option. One. So we're gonna go ahead and do number three now. So after this one, I'll end it because I'm getting hungry. The district's tunnels warrant exploration. The wind feels good, rushing through your feathers. How quickly can you fly through? This should be an interesting one. Nailed it there. <laughs> that was a good one. A few times I got worried, so I had to slow down a little bit. Nailed it. Thinking that was on easy, so. Alright, so there's other online players, so, um. Not too bad. I got fourth. Alright, so where are we at on recording time? Yeah, we got time for one more. So I only had like 40 minutes left on my camera, so. So there's uh, apparently a lot more in terms of what you can do in this game. So, oh there you go, I got one out of 20, so we know how many those are. So far, worth the 40 bucks. I think it's 40. Show your agility in the air. And let the animals in the area know the skies around this district are yours. All right, so complete this challenge to unlock Ghost Race mode. So do I do a run and then I race my ghost?
It's really hard to aim for that center point because I don't know if it has to be the little icon that's in front of you or just the center of your body. I got fourth again just to shy from third. <laughs> you know, it's funny how first place has ego on the name. Hmm. So I think that will be it for to well today I'm going to continue this of course because it's sent in for review. Actually perfect timing because we just unlocked chapter two. Two of a feather. Alright, so yeah, perfect timing. So that was all of chapter one. Uh I pressed the continue, so hopefully nothing pops up. Okay. So let's go ahead and go to the menu, wherever the game is. You know, I bet on camera I look like a, a weirdo because I'm doing it like this. But uh, one of the things I'm going to say is that if you have neck problems, this is something that you probably won't be able to play. Just throwing that out there. Get that. And that. So it's actually pretty cool. Just that freedom of flight, I love it. And what's cool is that if you also take off the headset, apparently it knows if you have the headset on because then the screen will go blank. But if you guys have any questions, let me know in the comment section down below. We will continue this. Like I said, I received this on, uh, what's today, the second or third as I'm recording this video. So um, I'll see you guys next time.